Praise the name of the Lord. Shalom, family. Once again, you're welcome. Welcome to this amazing, this great, awesome world, awesome session. It's your friend and your sister, Dr. Ayo, and I agree with word from the Lord. I appreciate all those that you carry to this particular session. Do you always stop by whenever we do new video uploads? Returning viewers and returning subscribers, God bless you amazingly. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hallelujah. Now, I have this word that God gave me. The Lord said you left a scar. You left a scar in their lives. You left a scar in their hearts. You left a scar, a footprint, you know. You left something that they can, they, each time they look at that particular thing, they keep rem remembering what, you know, they keep remembering the moment. They keep remembering what you did. Hallelujah. Now, God says, I should tell you this. You know, truth sometimes, you know, there's this, this, this great man of God said, truth, before truth changes a man or before truth brings about a certain transformation in the life of somebody, it first of all makes the man mad. That means it first of all makes the man very angry. It first of all makes the man to, you know, like fight it. It's difficult to, to speak the truth and not be forth. It's difficult for you to speak the truth and stones are not raised at you. So the fact that they don't agree with you, the fact that they, 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 they are arguing with you, they are refusing your view, your point of view, doesn't mean that your point of view is wrong. I hear God says you spoke the right thing. And the reason why you left a scar in the life of this person is because many, many days later, Many months after, many years after you left, that is when they realize what you told them because it's coming to pass like a prophecy. It's coming to pass like a, a, a clear, they are having a clear vision and it makes them to think about what you had done, about the, the you know, what you pushed them to do. Hallelujah. And God says, keep doing that which is right. Keep doing it and don't stop doing it because you are literally leaving footprints in the life of these people. And although you might not see it, it might not look like it right now. But as the day goes by, that which you are doing become like a scar. And that scar always reminds them of how good you are, how great you are, and the things that they have been able to achieve because of you. Don't stop what you're doing. Keep doing it. Keep being the motivation. Hallelujah.